The purpose of this video is to show you how to use dance mat typing. Right now, I am inside level one. Whenever I take my students in, I start with the home row. Step number one is to click right here where you see the number one. On the next screen, this blue button says, this game requires a keyboard to play. So you either need to press the long space bar or the enter key on your computer in order to begin. Hi there, rock and rollers. We're going to have us a blast. Got those tapping feet on the ground? Then we're ready to rock and roll. Follow Gary's instructions to learn the moves you'll need for typing. Look at the records on the bottom bar to see how far through you are. First kids, find me two keys, F and J, each with a bump. Left pointing finger on the F, type an F. You will notice at the top of your screen that the letter F is located right here, letting you know that that's what you're supposed to type right now. At the bottom of the screen, Gary's instructions appear. Type an F. You'll also notice on the left and the right that Gary's hands are placed right on the keyboard, just like your hands should be placed. If you cannot hear Gary while this program is running, maybe you accidentally clicked right here where um, it shows the speaker, which means that the volume would be off. Using the keyboard, not the computer screen, I'm going to come to the keyboard and type the letter F. Right point and finger on the J. Type a J. Gary just gave me more instructions, letting me know that I'm supposed to type the letter J. Right over here, the index finger of the right hand is pointing to the letter J. Up at the top, it says the letter J. And down at the bottom, it says type a J. I'm going to use my index finger on my right hand to touch the letter J on the keyboard. Also note that the only letters that are colored are these letters right here in the home row. Those are the only letters we're using right now. So I'm going to touch the letter J. Now rest your other fingers next door on the home row keys. Left hand fingers on F, D, S, and A. Right hand fingers on J, K, L, and the semicolon. Groovy! Now try typing these letters in a row. You'll notice at the top of the screen we have some letters right here, and they are black. I'm going to use my hands on these keys down here in order to type these letters. When I make a mistake, there are two things that happen. Not only is there a sound, but the letter on the keyboard begins to wiggle. Watch what happens. Me next. Me next. Oops. 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 Me next. Oops. These two tools together remind me that I'm supposed to click on the correct letter. So let me finish these letters. Now for the space bar. Use either of your thumbs to make a space. Go on, have a go. Make a space. Well, kid, this is your big moment. See if you can type all these words with the correct fingers. Now Gary has asked me to type the letters that I see right up here. You'll also notice that there's a space in between these words. So down on the keyboard, it's my job to use my thumb to click right here where it shows a space. So watch while I do this. Now, if you make a mistake, if I type a letter on the keyboard that's the wrong letter, it's going to show you exactly which key I'm supposed to press. Houston, we have liftoff. Team, thank you so much for watching and have a great day.